Kazakh or Kazakh Cyrillic, Kazakhsa or Kazakh Tili, Arabic, Kazakhsa or Kazakh Tili, pronounced Qus, Qzqtl belongs to the Kipchak branch of the Turkic languages. It is closely related to Nogai, Kyrgyz, and Karakalpak. Kazakh is the official language of the Republic of Kazakhstan and a significant minority language in the Ili Kazakh Autonomous Prefecture in Xinjiang, China and in the Bayan Olgi Province of Mongolia. Kazakh is also spoken by many ethnic Kazakhs through the former Soviet Union approximately 472,000 in Russia according to the 2010 Russian census, Afghanistan, Iran, Turkey, and Germany. Like other Turkic languages, Kazakh is an agglutinative language, and it employs vowel harmony. In October 2017, Kazakh President Nursultan Nazarbayev decreed that the government would transition from using Cyrillic to the Latin alphabet by 2025. President Nazarbayev signed on February 19, 2018 an amendment to the decree of October 26, 2017 No. 569, on translating the Kazakh alphabet from Cyrillic alphabet to the Latin script. The amended alphabet uses shish and ch for the Kazakh sounds, s, and c, and eliminates the use of apostrophes. Geographic distribution The Kazakh language has its speakers mainly Kazakhs spread over a vast territory from the Tian Shan to the western shore of the Caspian Sea. Kazakh is the official state language of Kazakhstan, with nearly 10 million speakers based on information from the CIA World Factbook on Population and the Proportion of Kazakh Speakers. In China, more than 1 million ethnic Kazakhs and Kazakh speakers reside in the Ili Kazakh Autonomous Prefecture of Xinjiang. Topic. Writing system The oldest known written records of languages closely related to Kazakh were written in the Old Turkic alphabet, though it is not believed that any of these varieties were direct predecessors of Kazakh. Modern Kazakh, going back approximately 1,000 years, was written in the Arabic script until 1929, when Soviet authorities introduced a Latin-based alphabet, and then a Cyrillic in 1940. In presenting a strategic plan in April 2017, Kazakh President Nursultan Nazarbayev described the 20th century as a period in which the Kazakh language and culture have been devastated. Nazarbayev ordered Kazakh authorities to create a Latin Kazakh alphabet by the end of 2017, so written Kazakh could return to a Latin script starting in 2018. As of 2018, Kazakh is written in Cyrillic in Kazakhstan and Mongolia, Kazakh is written in Latin in Kazakhstan, while more than one million Kazakh speakers in China use an Arabic derived alphabet similar to the one that is used to write Uyghur. On October 26, 2017, Nazarbayev issued Presidential Decree 569 for the change to a finalized Latin variant of the Kazakh alphabet and ordered that the government's transition to this alphabet be completed by 2025, a decision taken to emphasize. Kazakh culture after the era of Soviet rule and to facilitate the use of digital devices. But the initial decision to use a novel orthography employing apostrophes, which make the use of many popular tools for searching and writing text difficult, has generated controversy. The alphabet was revised the following year by Presidential Decree 637 of 19 February 2018 and the use of apostrophes was discontinued and replaced with the use of diacritics and digraphs. Nazarbayev first brought up the topic of using the Latin alphabet instead of the Cyrillic alphabet as the official script for Kazakh in Kazakhstan in October 2006. A Kazakh government study released in September 2007 said that a switch to a Latin script over a 10 to 12 year period was feasible, at a cost of $300 million. The transition was halted temporarily on December 13, 2007, with President Nazarbayev declaring. For 70 years the Kazakhstanis read and wrote in Cyrillic. More than 100 nationalities live in our state. Thus we need stability and peace. We should be in no hurry in the issue of alphabet transformation. However, on January 30, 2015, the Minister of Culture and Sports Aristenbek Mukamedialy announced that a transition plan was underway, with specialists working on the orthography in order to accommodate the phonological aspects of the language. However, many citizens state that the officially introduced alphabet needs lots of improvements and changes. 
Moreover, Kazakh becomes the only Turkic language which will be using shish, ch, after the intentions of the Uzbek government to abandon the shish, ch digraphs due to its impracticality. Phonology Kazakh exhibits tongue root vowel harmony, with some words of recent foreign origin, usually of Russian or Arabic origin, as exceptions. There is also a system of rounding harmony which resembles that of Kyrgyz, but which does not apply as strongly and is not reflected in the orthography. Topic: <laughs> Consonants. The following chart depicts the consonant inventory of standard Kazakh. Many of the sounds, however, are allophones of other sounds or appear only in recent loan words. For example, q is allophone to k and is allophone to per gram to and to. The 18 consonant phonemes listed by Vida are without parentheses. Since these are phonemes, their listed place and manner of articulation are very general and will vary from what is shown. The borrowed phonemes f, v, t and x only occur in recent borrowings, mostly from Russian. Non-Kazakh sounds are in square brackets. In the table, the elements left of a divide are voiceless, while those to the right are voiced. Topic: <laughs> Vowels. Kazakh has a system of twelve phonemic vowels, three of which are diphthongs. The rounding contrast and a generally only occur as phonemes in the first syllable of a word, but do occur later allophonically. See the section on harmony below for more information. Moreover, the a sound has been included artificially due to the influence of Arabic, Persian, and later Tatar languages during the Islamic period. According to Vida, the front back quality of vowels is actually one of neutral versus retracted tongue root. Phonetic values are paired with the corresponding character in Kazakh Cyrillic and current Latin alphabets. O is mid front, tilde tilde O. O is close mid back, O tilde tilde U. The problem of the diphthongs. The diphthongs such as J I, I acute, W U, Y acute, and I, E, E, as well as E, U, A appeared due to the strong Russian influence during the Soviet period. The Soviets decided to write the Russian names and words the same way in other languages and introduced alien letters and sounds to the Kazakh language. However, most of Kazakhs who do not speak Russian simply cannot pronounce them and replace those sounds with Kazakh equivalents. Moreover, these Russian sounds replaced some Kazakh letters and artificially created the diphthongs, violating the law of syngarmony. For example, the word for to study oku became oku the word tiu replaced two words such as to touch taiju and to forbid. Even nowadays different dictionaries give different versions of words. In reality, most of the specialists who work at the language institution and who created the new Latin alphabet were born and raised in the Soviet Union. Thus, they firmly state to preserve the Russian letters in Kazakh language while young generation with no authority recall scientists to give the syngarmony back to the Kazakh language. Thus, Kazakh Russian diphthongs historically has been, i.e., i-y, u-u-w, u with i with i-w, e-e -E in the beginning of a word, e-yo this combination of sounds doesn't exist in Kazakh, a-ya, ye, ya, u-y-u-w, u with ye with y-i-w. Topic. Morphology and syntax Kazakh is generally verb final, though various permutations on SOV subject -object -verb word order can be used, depending on the logically stressed part of the sentence. Inflectional and derivational morphology, both verbal and nominal, in Kazakh, exists almost exclusively in the form of agglutinative suffixes. Kazakh is a nominative accusative, head final, left branching, dependent marking language. Topic. Pronouns Kazakh has eight personal pronouns The declension of the pronouns is outlined in the following chart. Singular pronouns with the exception of cis, which used to be plural exhibit irregularities, while plural pronouns don't. Irregular forms are highlighted in bold. In addition to the pronouns, there are several more sets of morphemes dealing with person. Topic. Tense, aspect and mood 
Kazakh may express different combinations of tense, aspect and mood through the use of various verbal morphology or through a system of auxiliary verbs, many of which might better be considered light verbs. The present tense is a prime example of this. Progressive tense in Kazakh is formed with one of four possible auxiliaries. These auxiliaries: odor, sit, tur, stand, zur, go and zat. Lie, encode various shades of meaning of how the action is carried out and also interact with the lexical semantics of the root verb, telic and non-telic actions, semulfactives, durative and non-durative, punctual, etc. There are selectional restrictions on auxiliaries, motion verbs, such as baru and kelu may not combine with odor. Any verb, however, can combine with zat lie, to get a progressive tense meaning. While it is possible to think that different categories of aspect govern the choice of auxiliary, it is not so straightforward in Kazakh. Auxiliaries are internally sensitive to the lexical semantics of predicates, for example, verbs describing motion. In addition to the complexities of the progressive tense, there are many auxiliary converb pairs that encode a range of aspectual, modal, volitional, evidential and action modificational meanings. For example, the pattern ip cru, with the auxiliary verb cru indicates that the subject of the verb attempted or tried to do something compare the Japanese temiru temiru construction. <laughs> Annotated text with gloss From. Menon Kazakhstanum. My Kazakhstan. The national anthem of Kazakhstan. See also BGN, PCGN Romanization of Kazakh Turkic languages Kazakh literature Languages of Kazakhstan References Further reading Kara, David Shomfai 2002, Kazakh, Lincoln Europa, ISBN 9783895864 794 Mark Kirkner, Kazakh and Karakalpak, in, The Turkic Languages. Ed., by Lars Johansson and A. A. Sato. London, U. A., Routledge, 1998. Routledge Language Family Descriptions. S.318-332. External links Kazakh Cyrillic Latin new converter Kazakh Cyrillic Latin old Arabic converter Kazakh language, alphabet and pronunciation Aliya S. Kuzabakova. Past, present and future of language policy in Kazakhstan. M.A. Thesis, University of North Dakota, 2003 Russian Kazakh Kazakh Russian Dictionary Kazakh Language Recordings, British Library Kazakh, Apertium Kazakh Turkish Dictionary Kazakhstan in the CIA World Factbook U.S. Peace Corps Kazakh Language Courses Transcribed to HTML